my name is Amy with Price Yak. I want to personally welcome you and congratulate you on finding the best automation platform for dropship arbitrage. On this video, I'm going to go over the four main key features that Price Yak has available to you. I will touch on each individual feature only briefly in this video. So as you move forward in your training on the videos that are coming up, you're going to find a more in-depth training on each feature. There are many features here within Price Yak which will benefit you. However, I'm actually going to cover now just the four main features, which are listing creation. You'll see how easy it is to take a listing off of one website and post it to another. The next is repricing. Without lifting a finger, Price Yak will automatically adjust the price of your listing using the source price so that you aren't losing any money due to price changes. Next one is Auto ordering. This is an additional feature that all but fully automates the entire process for you. An item is ordered from you, it automatically gets purchased, paid for, and shipped to your buyer. Plus, I'm going to go over managed accounts, an exclusive service that we provide to make the whole process that much easier for you. And then finally, the fourth feature that I'm going to go over in this video is our messaging system. This is a huge benefit for those who use stealth accounts. But for every user, the ease of listing items and responding to buyer inquiries all from one place is time-saving to say the least. So let's go ahead and get started with the first feature, listing creation. What we are going to do is click on create listings from the top left of your screen once you're logged into your store settings. And then we're going to click on create listing. This is going to take us to this page where you will see this large box. We're going to choose the source market. And for this example, we're going to choose Amazon US. Inside the box, we will paste the ASAN numbers of the items from Amazon that we want to list. So you can list multiple items at once by just hitting enter in between. So let's come over here to Amazon and grab an ASAN number, we'll scroll down. We gotta take all this time here to find that ASAN number. And then we'll just switch right back. And then if you wanna put more than one in at a time, like I said, you'll just hit enter. And let's find one more item for this example. Again, spending this time to scroll through the listing and look for that ASAN number. And there we go. So all that you're gonna do at this point is just go ahead and click list now and you're good to go. Those items will be uploaded to your eBay account. I wanna show you one small thing before we move forward. I say small thing, but it's actually a huge thing. Going back to create listings, we wanna get back to that page with the box. And if you don't already have your price yak, Chrome extension, that's what you're gonna to wanna to do. Just Google Chrome extensions, click on the store, and search for Price Yak. Here you will find the Yak Pal. Go ahead and install the Yak Pal, as you can see up here in the corner, I already have it installed. And this magic, amazing tool is going to make everything so much easier for you. So remember how I just said that we spend all this time searching through the listing and trying to find that ASIN number. And there it is again. So what this tool will do, to go ahead and click on it and show item grabber, is I can just click load items from page and it automatically gives me that ASIN number without having to take the time to scroll for it. Going back, to another item, and let's say this one. The box is going to pop up for you again, and just click load items from page. And you can do this over and over and over again with all the items that you've determined you would like to list. Again, here we go, load items from the page. And then one more thing I'm going to show you about this tool is, let's say you've narrowed it down and you want to list all these items or at least most of them 
from the main search result page, you can click load items from page and look at that. It gives you every single item from the entire page. You go over, copy it, paste it here, and then just click list now. So that is the listing creation feature. The next feature that we're gonna go over is repricing. With repricing, Price Yak will automatically keep up with the ever-changing prices on your source market and adjust the prices for you in your store. This is very important because source prices, especially on Amazon, change very frequently. And what you don't want to have happen is the price on Amazon go up, but your store price did not. Because then you may have to buy an item to ship to your customer that costs more than what your customer paid for it. So to check your source settings, we're gonna be right here on your store page and just come down on the left side box, source settings, and again, we're using Amazon US for this example, so we're gonna click this. And here are the settings. So here you can change the stock quantity, your minimum margins, and you can put in your margin percent and your margin fixed dollar amount. So for me, for right now, I have 2%, which is very low. A lot of people want to come and see 6 or 8 or 10. Some people are looking for $1.50. So whatever it is, that's okay. And you're just going to click Save Repricing Settings. If you need some help deciding what your margins should be, definitely reach out to us because we can help you with that. So to see how this works, you can test these settings. So here it says, enter the price of the item, including shipping on Amazon. So we're gonna go over to Amazon, find this item. The price is $69.98, $69.98. Enter the number of sales of the item on the destination market, one, and click continue. And here it's going to give you the exact configurations as to how it decided what your price is going to be. This item is going to be listed on your store for $87.23. And you can go through and read these calculations if you really wanna to get to the nitty gritty and understand all the math behind it. Or like me, you can just be thankful that it's a computer doing it, it's all automatic. It's gonna get it right for you and that's one of the best features of Price Yak is that you don't actually have to think about all this math and figure it out and calculate each single listing and what your sales price should be. So moving on to the next feature, the next feature we're gonna cover is auto ordering. Of course, the repricing feature is an extremely useful benefit that would otherwise be time consuming and daunting. However, right up there with automatic price adjusting is auto ordering. Auto ordering entirely removes the time consuming tasks of copying a buyer's address, entering it into your source market, locating the item they bought on that source market, putting it in the cart, adding a gift note, ordering it, paying for it, shipping it, marking the item as shipped on your target market, and leaving positive feedback for your buyer. In addition, when using managed accounts here with Price Yak, you'll be able to auto process any return requests as well. To use auto ordering, there is a small fee per transaction. However, the amount of time and work it saves you is well worth it. To use auto ordering from your main store settings page, just make sure that you have enable auto ordering checked. Now you've heard me mention managed accounts. This is a free service that we offer if you're using auto ordering. If you've already been drop shipping using Amazon as a source market, then you may have run into some issues. For example, your auto ordering platform may have had issues logging into your Amazon account on your behalf, or you may have had your Amazon account frozen. You may be paying for Amazon Prime, or you might not be able to ship your orders with the two-day Prime shipping. Also, you've been handling all the time-consuming returns on your own as well. So with managed accounts, all of your orders will be processed through your managed account thus not requiring you to have and maintain an Amazon buying account. Simply fund your managed account using PayPal and Price Yak will use those 
funds each and every time they are placing an order for you. With managed accounts, you will never lose a sale again due to Amazon account issues. To access your managed account settings, simply scroll down on the left-hand side to auto order settings and click on managed accounts. So finally, this brings us to the fourth feature that we're going to cover in this video, and that is our messaging system. To access your target market messaging system, just click on your store and scroll down to messages. From here, you can view, open, read, and reply to all of your messages. If you operate multiple stealth accounts, this allows you to reply to messages easily without having to log in to each individual stealth account. So that's it. The four main features of Price Gap, listing creations, repricing, auto ordering, and managed accounts, and our messaging system. So thank you for watching.